This is the GoPC virtual desktop. It's a computer system that will appear on almost any computer screen that I'm sitting at, whether it be a Windows PC, Apple Mac, Linux Workstation. And you can see that I've got a lot of normal desktop applications in here, pre-configured, ready to run. If I go into my computer, we'll look at my file system, and I've got a samples directory where there's some interesting files I'd like to show you. So this is a 15 megabyte PDF document. It would take several minutes to download across the internet normally, but on GoPC I'll click and it loads instantaneously. I can go to the last page, page 761, go back to the top again, make some changes, save it, and it will be saved instantaneously. Let's look at an Excel spreadsheet. It's an XLS file built in Microsoft Excel a few years ago. I'm using here OpenOffice, which we've pre-configured to be compatible with Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. So we're eliminating the Microsoft license costs here, and we have a normal Microsoft experience. This spreadsheet has many tabs. The tabs have thousands of calculations in them. It's a large spreadsheet, and the whole thing works. So an Excel spreadsheet, but without the Microsoft costs involved. If I look into my shares, what's fantastic about this is it's effectively a file server. I'm sharing this directory here with about a dozen other people around the world. And if I look into the minutes and meetings here, go down to the document that I want. This here is a Microsoft Word document. It was built in OpenOffice and yet is fully compatible. I can email this to somebody with Microsoft Office PC and they would be able to make changes and bring it back to me and it would all be fully compatible. If we leave the desktop applications alone now, and look at web browser based application. I'm using here a thing called Zimbra. Zimbra is the equivalent of a Microsoft Exchange email system. I'll log in as my account. And what's really interesting here is the amount of data that I've got. I've imported the last 12 years of my PST files from Microsoft Outlook. You can see in my inbox I've got 18,000 unread emails out of 54,000 emails, but across the entire data set, We've got hundreds of thousands of emails. If I do a complex search on this now, so to make things really difficult, I'll go and look for two words, BMW and Audi. I'll do a search across not just the emails, but the attachments like Word documents, Excel spreadsheets. So here we go, a complex search of hundreds of thousands of emails. Starting now, and it's finished. I'll go into the particular one I wanted. Here it is, and yes, there it is. That's the car of my dreams. So it gets even better, attaching uh, large documents can happen instantaneously. We have project management software in here, I can edit my photographs, pretty much anything you would do on a normal PC, you can do on GoPC, but without any dependence on the local physical machine. And when you're finished, log off and log in again on any other machine.